Of all the items packed at this UPS store in Pleasant Grove, the one Utah Highway Patrol Trooper Jared Clanton brought in is about as unique as it gets. Okay. Not because of what it was, but because of how he got it and why he's happy to get rid of it. Kind of important for somebody, you know. Somebody's crying. The story begins at the mouth of American Fort Canyon on Christmas Eve when Clanton was on his normal patrol. I caught something out of the corner of my eye and I was like, that was out of place. So he turned around to see what it was and sure enough, it was a Christmas present. Only thing is, he didn't know who it belonged to, but he did have one clue. I didn't have a lot to go off of other than um, the sticker um, for the store that sold it out of Minnesota. But when Clanton realized it was a Lego toy, it hit him because he has a Lego toy too. I do, yeah. The little Superman my son gave me, so wanted me to put it on my keys. So Clanton decided to do whatever he could to find this Lego's boy. He put it on the Highway Patrol's Facebook page, got in touch with the store in Minnesota. Today, two weeks later, his cell phone finally rang. When I saw Minnesota, I was like, Oh my goodness. It seems the mother of the boy that Lego toy was going to went back to the store to buy another one. Mentioned to the cashier how she lost the same toy traveling in Utah, and the cashier remembered the Utah trooper who called. The mother couldn't believe it. I was just so grateful um, for Jerry Clanton and his determination to make sure a child didn't go without a Christmas gift. That was just so overwhelming to me. And get this, tomorrow is the boy's 11th birthday, so Clanton decided to ship it overnight out of his own pocket. It made it worth it. And, and that's really, that's what it's all about, right? For an 11-year-old boy, tomorrow is going to be a special day, thanks to this Superman. Alex Cabrero, KSL 5 News.